Okay. Hooray! I didn't commit suicide again. Okay, I'm gonna put it off even more. <laughs> I'm very good at procrastinating, guys. Just so you know. Anything interesting back here? Like some diamond in the wall? Nope. Okay. Now after that 8 stack, can't complain too much. Although, I mean, I did have to go up against that double creeper to the face. So I don't know how incredibly fair that was. But, uh, you know, you know that was a lot of diamond, I guess. I will let it slide. Okay, now I think I can put it off no longer. I need to get up here and light this place up. And let us start with this. I could have sworn this is more or less where I saw the thing watching me from. Wow. That's just one source block of lava doing all that, it looks like. Okay, so the darkness is above me. Thank you, game. <laughs> or as I might call you, Captain Obvious. <laughs> okay. Oh, that wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. Although if I ever take out that lava, there's going to be a lot of darkness I'm going to be le leaving back here. Hey look, gold. <laughs> Ah, hi. All right. Where is ah? Skeleton head was right here, I believe. Okay. Yes. Yet another place I had been meaning to come back to. Because I think... I'm not certain. Get out of here. <laughs> hey. No. Well, whatever. I thought I had left a little pocket of darkness back here. Looks like I was wrong. Okay. Because, although... Hmm. Making no sense with my words again. <laughs> I was going to say, although there is that zombie, and we did hear the a zombie last time we were through here, so But it's only one, so I pretty much doubt it's a spawner, a dungeon or anything worth looking at. So I am going to ignore it and just grab up some gold. Since that is kind of what we're in here for. Yeah, that's the source of the water. Mm, don't know if I want to get rid of it just yet. Yes, I've been hearing a zombie from up here a long time now. <laughs> and you're not up here. Hmm. Okay, we'll get rid of that water. Like, right above my head. And that's where you can stay. <laughs> ah. Yeah. Okay. So that one thing of lava made the lava all the way back down there. Stuff flows a long time. Okay. 
Hitting up a couple more spots I wanted to light up again. Oh, not again, but again, places I wanted to light up, I should say. Make sure it has enough light. Even in the instance or whatever, uh, that I end up removing the lava. Whew, okay. So we are just uh, kind of rushing through here now, aren't we? Starting to thin out the dark areas. Might have to take a little time off screen to see if I can find some new darkness. But I think I will do a little more exploring on screen for you guys. Just in case uh, someone wants to Say hello, as I'm so fond of saying. Um, ah, okay. Yep. Mm. I finally got rid of the water. Okay, that's why this area looked a little different. Yeah, there was stuff over here, I remember now. That was a little bit of lag there, Minecraft. Thanks. You know, we still have not actually figured out how to get back to that gold yet. As big as this place has been, I keep assuming I'm just going to run into it eventually. Long hallway with uh, mostly nothing. A little bit cold, though. Yeah, I just used up all mine. All right then. All right. Now that we are done with that, let us apparently get some more iron. There seems to be a nice bit of it back here. Okay. And since we're picking up iron, we might as well get this stuff. Alright. So... There it is, skeleton. Hmm. I wonder if this is even worth bothering with. No, no it was not. <laughs> Just a big pocket of dirt. Okay then. And I trapped myself. Alright. Well. Hmm. I really want to go back to where we were a couple episodes ago by now. And figure out just where that gold was. Hmm. It's kind of starting to bug me now. It's like, I, I just know it's turning into a hotbed for spawns. And I need to make it stop. <laughs> Not before I get this iron, apparently. <laughs> okay. Once again, on second thought, I do remember there's a redstone torch up here I left. That's telling me if 
find out what is up here. If anything anymore. <laughs> Yeah, that's a, that's a bit awkward. But I think I can work with it. Ooh, hello. Hello to you. Where does this go? Come on, mouse. Pretty sure we're close enough. Thank you. Hmm. I was kind of expecting to run into that skeleton and zombie for some reason. Well, that was kind of disappointing. But hey, at least we found more darkness. And do I want to get rid of this water? I don't remember. Started to like leaving water around for some reason. Oh yes, this this water needed to go. Very, very much so go away. Alright. That takes care of one of the double falls. How much of that's still dark? All of it. Super. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. Hmm. Sure, why not? Let's try tunneling. Let's see what we come up with. Hope this is far enough up. Nice. Haha. -ha. <laughs> okay then. Sounds like we're getting really close to the surface. I can hear it raining already. Wow. So those two zombies that jumped me came from right here. <laughs> That's just crazy. Alright, time for you to go now. Goodbye. 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 Well, I think I need to get rid of the lava now, because now it's just going to go and fill that whole area back up down there. I mean, a zombie did fall down there earlier, so, you know, I'm losing much, but... Oh, okay. Never mind. The water fixed the problem for me. What the heck? Where is the darkness cave? <laughs> hmm. <laughs> okay then. Ah. Now I can get coal I was supposed to originally. Alright. There we go. Alright, so if any of you know where that gold was, let me know, because I've gotten myself lost in terms of figuring out where that was. And now that I think about it, remember that place Oh, probably five or six episodes back, I was talking about, yeah, we looked, we ran past, and turns out there was darkness, but for some reason or another, I completely forgot about it, and just kept walking past it on the way out. Well, if memory serves, it's down that other hallway. But, who knows. Been wrong a lot lately. Ah, good was here. Yes. I dropped that torch, looked in and saw pretty much this, and was like, uh-uh. I gotta do this on screen. 
Hello, zombie. Yes, come to the lava. Die. <laughs> Actually, now that I think about it, there's a bunch of darkness I left up near the skeleton spawner. Yes, you two come to the lava. You burn. You burn. <sighs> that was close. Crap. Ugh, where did you go? <laughs> Trying to hum nonchalantly so they don't see me. <laughs> Ooh. Isn't that interesting? Wow, I, I left the torch exactly where that little block was. That's kind of funny. All right, let's go this way. Let's... Come here. Bye-bye. <laughs> ah, I thought Notch fixed that many versions ago. Many updates ago, I should say. Hmm. Definitely down near a bunch of gold. I like that. I'm not liking the fact that there's water pouring in from the ceiling, because... Oh. Well, yeah. That is exactly why. Alright. I'm going to leave this in too, just in case something tries to jump me while I'm making torches. And yes, I said torches this time and not coal. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Okay. I'm going to leave that be to see where the zombie ended up. No, that's backwards. <laughs> Thank you, hands. Wow. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> Thought that was just another opening for the water. Did not realize it was actually the other waterfall. Ugh. I hate it when it does this. See, there, there is absolutely no, no reason for the water to be flowing here right now. It's just super glitchy. Uh, there. That's better. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. Pretty sure I left a torch on that one, that's why I'm not knocking it out. Okay, so the skeleton's back there somewhere. Hmm. I think I'm gonna keep headed down. Because I know it's danger. Whoa. Very dangerous. Everywhere else. Thought I saw more than one swimming down there. Okay then. I think it's time we got out of here. See if I can get this in time. There we go. Sounds like the skeleton finally killed himself. Thank you, Mr. Skeleton. It was very kind of you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Angry zombie. Dead zombie. <laughs> Ugh, not the only zombie. Awesome. This cave might just be the death of me, as someone was suggesting. Especially if it's got me in this precarious place where there's stuff above and below me. Okay. 
Okay, I can do that. See if I can't get down there safely. Or, you know, safe ish, at least. Okay, I see some mushrooms. A pit of blackness. But I hear something walking on dirt. Which way to go first, though? I think that's a small room. Let's try... Ha ha ha! I was right. Okay. Now let us... Oh. It was not a deep dark hole. It was just obsidian. I feel silly now. Let's see. As long as there is something above my head, a nice ceiling roof-like thing... Whatever scary things are up there should be able to stay up there and not screw with me too badly. Wow. Look at the spread on these. Mushrooms, that is. Hey, look. A redstone torch I left myself. Huh. I wonder when I left this one. I mean, it connects to somewhere I've been then. That would be nice. Hello, mouse. I'd like to place a torch. Thank you. Hmm. Whoa. Buckets of lava. Hmm. Stop clanking. Freaking me out. Situations like this where F3 is very tempting, but you should always try to resist, because then, as scary as it is, that's kind of the whole reason. You're playing the game, isn't it? I mean, if it wasn't, you'd just throw it on peaceful. I mean, at least that's my opinion. And what is it with these creepers? They're like not dropping gunpowder anymore. <sighs> and that is why I keep cobblestone in spot number five all the time. So that way, when something crazy happens, I know exactly where to go for. Alright. I really wish I knew where that clanking was coming from. Now there's a find. Kind of what I thought. You piece of crap. Get out here. Ugh. You sneaky, sneaky skeleton. Where'd you even come from? I mean, I heard you from over here, but... I'm pretty sure there's nothing but lava all around. How did you get here? <sighs> Could have sworn he was going to be back here. Oh, I almost completely stumbled on this stuff already. That's kind of funny. Whoa. Gold. Hey, we did connect back. 
Woohoo! Woohoo! Awesome. <sighs> okay. I had a feeling we would. I'm just glad we actually did connect. Right back to where we were before. To where we were trying to get. <sighs> okay. I think I'm gonna need a break here soon. My arm is starting to shake from all the, from my nerves getting rattled over and over tonight. Ooh. Let's clear this out a little bit. It's probably just the three, but hey, never know. All right. There we go. Yep, just three. <sighs> a well-earned three. I finally got to take out a skeleton with a sword, and I wasn't in multiplayer. So as many of you know, skeletons on multiplayer are so pathetic. If you have a diamond sword, just walk up to them and go, yeah, and they're dead. <laughs> and maybe, maybe they'll get one shot off, but who cares? On the server, it's always easy, so that's like a whole heart, which, you know, big whoop. All right, what is, what it is over here? Baba lava. Oh. There wasn't much to that. Okay. Cool. Is it going to be the same for the water? Indeed it is. Okay. Cool. Cool. Got us some diamond. Doing pretty cool. Hmm. So. There we go. That's better. Hmm, I think, well, hmm. I kind of want to put the diamond away, but I know we left this spot back here. Actually, we left a hole, all this back here. So let's just, just go ahead and at least finish obsidianizing all this. And I think once we're done with that, unless there's some more diamond, I'm going to run everything back to the cave base one more time. I'll show you guys our loot as it currently stands from all this spelunking recently. And I think I will call this set good when we get to that point. <laughs>